Problem 3. From 1 to 1,999, how many numbers, when added to 5,678, causes at least one carrying of digits? First, what is a carrying digit? Um, if you have something like 19 plus 23, and you stack it, right? This is basic addition. 9 plus 3 is 12. But only the one digit from 12, which is 2, can stay in that one digit place. The other um, 10 in, in 12 has to travel over uh, to the tens place. So this is a carry of digits. I'm sure you guys all know that. So now we know that there's a number. And from 1 to 1999, there could be one digit numbers, two digit numbers, or um, three digit numbers, or of course, uh, or of course, four digit numbers. So five, six, seven, eight, and let's stack it um, with four place values. Okay, and remember, since there are, there can be three digit numbers, two digit numbers, or one digit numbers, not every one of these squares has to be filled up with a digit. Now let's think about what exactly, um, would 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 happen if if in the ones digit there was a carrying of digits? Eight would either be one be zero or one. The reason why it's not any higher is because you know there's it's from one to one thousand nine hundred ninety nine. So it's not really that big of a number when you compare it to the rest of the four digit numbers under ten thousand. Now let's look at seven. Well, if 7 is added to something um, and there's a carry, it can be 0, 1, or 2. For 6, it can be 0, 1, 2, 3, and there's probably not enough space, so I'm going to shift it up. And for 6, I mean for 5, it would be 0, 1, 2, 3, Four. So these are the different possibilities when any number from 1 through 1,999, the different possibilities that um, this number, that, that the final sum can have. So we take all of these, all of these possibilities um, and we multiply them. 2, 4, 3, 2, and of course we need to minus 1. So that gives us final 47, and our final answer is 47.